You came. Good. I'm aware I've been somewhat quiet following your success on Tython. Don't mistake my reticence for apathy. Truth is, I have a great deal to say. Now that we're alone, we can have a real dialogue. Darth Arcus wouldn't appreciate you going behind his back like this. No, I don't imagine he would. Especially considering what I have to say. Darth Arcus wasn't entirely forthcoming about his reasons for invading the Jedi Temple. Not even with me. He was after a very specific item. An artifact. I overheard Arcus talking to Go. It did seem like they had some ulterior motive. If I knew more, I could determine what that motive is. But there's very good reason to be concerned about it. Meaning? I now believe that the Republic's attack on Korriban wasn't a retaliation for Tython. It was intended to coincide with our own attack. Attacking Korriban while the Empire still held the Jedi Temple didn't make much sense to me at the time. It still doesn't. Nor should it, not from our current vantage point. But a wider context may exist that could explain recent events. There's something in the Force that I've never felt before. It exists nowhere and everywhere at once, rising, growing. That sounds ominous. I think I sense this growth because I'm tied to it somehow. Maybe by association to Darth Arcus. I think... I think the Empire is in terrible danger. Someone like you, Commander. Most would never trust you, but you're practically the only one I trust right now. Help me unravel this mystery. Can't think of anyone else I'd rather do some unraveling with. Is that right? Well, I'm afraid there's nothing for us to act on just yet. I'll keep my eyes and ears open. You do the same. I have to be at Arcus's side now, but I'll remain in touch. I promise. <laughs>